Ah, young wizard. So good to see one of our best and brightest return from a career of adventuring. How can I help you? Well, Archmage, to be blunt, we need to know everything that you might know on the topic of Lichdom. That's an incredibly taboo subject. We understand your magnificence, but this is incredibly important. We need all the information we can on identifying, disrupting the abilities of, and destroying a lich. The quest we're on is of legendary importance, and it may have significant implications for the wider realm. We already attempted to obtain that knowledge from the Artificers Guild, but they declined for reasons we... Oh, rather not disclose. Ah yes, they seem to be so wrapped up in the practical that they never pay attention to the theoretical or the plausible. So would you be willing to help us, Your Magnificence? Well, of course I'd be willing to help. Anything for such an accomplished people. Oh, thank all the gods. Friends, we might actually be able to do this. But for me to explain this properly, you'll need to understand the basic concepts of id refraction in the context of interplanar ego broadcast. Multiple biases need to be taken into account when understanding the two-way directional sway towards the median grid, although sway in this instance is something of a misnomer. It's almost universally accepted that goat's butter and ionized nails are best used in this portion of the thought experiment. Flim flam flibbity flim floor mcflib floor flib times two, not divided, that's very important. Do you have even the slightest idea of what they're talking about? No, nope. I've just sat here for the past eight hours nodding attentively and attempting to look like I'm taking it all in. I assume, though, that the wizard understands, and as long as the wizard understands, then we should be good. I lost all track after about the first 15 minutes. What? Yeah, it's been in one ear and out the other since then. I have sat here for the past eight hours debating whether I'm having an acid flashback, a stroke, or some combination of the two, and you're telling me that you don't have any understanding of what the hell they're on about either? Look, oh, Bard, it's just like any arcane thesis I've had to study. You just need to wait for the giant lecture to conclude, and then by the end of it, there will be a concise, plain common explanation that will put all of the ridiculous techno babble we've heard into context. We just need to be patient. And that's why Merlin was a hack who most likely had gambling debts. Which brings us to the end of the introduction to part one of our 15-part examination. That was just the fucking introduction?! Yes, but please save your questions for part eight when we have our Q&A session. No, 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 no! Your Magnificence, I am begging you, we're already on borrow time. We need this information in a format that we can all understand. Please can you explain this in simpler terms? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't realize this was an emergency. I, I can absolutely give you a plain common summation. I'll just need you to put in a formal request before I go on academic leave. Okay, when's that happening? Oh, uh, right now actually.